Yo. Yo, yo, yo. What's good? She sound like uh Wiz. That's Wiz. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What's good, my boy? I can't call it. It was good. Are you ready, ready for this rebirth? Oh, uh, yeah. I ain't going to be in the building, but I got that pay-per-view ready, you heard? All right. That's what it is. You, you got to give me your predictions, what you think going to happen. Let's start from the from the bottom of the card up to the top. Do you know uh, any of the uh, undercards? You know, um... Yeah, I know, uh... Funk? Yeah, I fuck with 280Z. I'm, I'm going Jersey. You already know. No unbiased, though. Ah, hey. You know what they're yeah. going to say. Oh, Jersey always buys with Jersey. Nah, 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 nah. Because uh, B-Magic and Shook, that's going to be a little uh, back and forth right there. Yeah, and I was I was actually like, you know what I mean? That's one of the battles I'm interested to see because of the style clash. Like, Shug said something in his interview with Three Letterman. He said, B-Magic don't even talk loud enough to beat me. Man, listen, but B-Magic be swinging in, in that ring, boy. I don't know. Yeah, him and Arch just had a classic. Yeah, I saw that. I don't know, man. It's going to be a, it's gonna be a, a long night, though, I, um, for Shug and B-Magic because they both in their bag right now. Exactly. And Shug trying to go the whole 2024 without losing a round. He he, yeah, he said he said it. He said he determined to get that champion of the year. He said, I'm not losing a round all 2024. But I know when y'all swing back this way in Jersey, I'm pulling up. Oh, facts. Oh, facts. You know, home, home is the next stop. What you, what you going to think, think going to be battle of the night, though? Is it going to be Shug and Badgett or is it going to be Sharon and Danny Myers? No funny shit. I think the battle of the night might be that dude, uh, Kasha and, uh, oh, real sick. Sick ain't yeah. nothing to play with neither. Yeah, nah, people don't realize that's a grudge right there. They both started on U-Dub. They both yeah. started in a tournament together. Bro, I was pulling up the U-Dub when they was on Irvin Turner. Facts. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a real real Jersey nigga. Like, I ain't, yeah. man. Facts, Prince Hall. You back for the Prince, Prince Hall days? Our Prince Hall. Facts. Yeah, I was, I was, I was in the building for Suge and Mav Hoff. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hitman and O Red, Calico and Surf. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So it's it's gonna be a crazy, crazy event. I'm looking to see what official do at home. She got home court event. It's her first home game. Yeah. Only time she battled her in New Orleans when she was in that two on two with Jazz. Part of my ground, you probably hear Elmo and shit. That's my baby, bro. Oh, nah, man, that's a part of fatherhood, man. It ain't about nothing. That's Word. a part of fatherhood. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna see what the fish is going to do, but I know how Loso, man, Loso is nothing to play with. Yeah, Loso. a fish, a fish, one of them ones too. Oh yeah, yeah, a fish. She, she that male. She give me that male version in that ring. She don't play, and she home. So I know she's gonna have all the peoples in the building. She already I said it. Know. Honestly, I, I ain't mean to cut you off, but I'm I'm definitely excited about the whole card. Uh, funny, yeah. In fact, and then Arson Koppel definitely gonna be a good one. Arson Koppel definitely gonna be a good one. I'm looking to see. I want to see what Geechee. I don't know why everybody like Ines and Geechee. Like, oh, Geechee, Geechee, yo, Ines. Ines I Ines forgot rap. about that shit, bro. Yeah. I got money. I got my money on Ines right now. Okay, okay. You the first one I heard. I just talked to Cause I was, what? I was at Gates of the Garden, and that's battle O Solo. And I'm chopping up with Ness, and that's like, yeah, I know everybody got me underdog. It's okay. I'm a I'm a surprise everybody. So I don't know. Geechee can't think it's a walk in the park, but Geechee is Geechee. Yeah, hell no. If, if Geechee do anything else besides what he usually do, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, because people forget Ness can rap. Like yeah, Ness, 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 one of my favorites. Yeah, like that's there ain't gonna be no walk in the park either way. I think uh, every match is a, every match is a dog fight. Yeah, every match is gonna be a dog fight, and then T Top and he coming up against the young boy, young DZ. So Top coming, and he said he coming through to kill something. So I'm interested to see. <laughs> I'm interested to see, especially that New Orleans crowd. I don't know how that New Orleans crowd is. Y'all got to get Gwitty on one of them cards, man. Okay, okay. 
Oh, yeah, but what are you, my boy? What are you, that's my dude right there. What are you, what? my boy? Oh, we got one of the killers on the card. It just joined there, my man, Capo. Capo, you there? Yeah, he did. You got yeah, he did. Let me let him uh add him the code. I, I do the yeah, dude. Oh, you got that? Add him. If you could just do the co-host, I add uh. All right, uh, yeah, do that, do that. Good, you cash. You up there? Yeah, yeah. Hold up. Yeah, you do all yeah, that. Hold up, hold up. Nah, if Cash are coming there doing that Mario shit like he did, when I <laughs> it, it's going to be a long night for that dude, sick too. Like, Yeah. Word up. Yeah. Right. That was one of my favorite bars from uh Cash when he said that little Mario scheme shit. You already know, man. Shit, you know, I, I just flew to Jersey. It's at home now, so fuck. It's going to be special. It's you dub It's still you dub It's just at home for me. So this is a home game. Yeah. Me, uh, send me the co-host. Uh, or cop yeah. of one. I'm about to send it to you now. You? You? Yo, yo, capo. Uh, you up there? Yeah, everybody up there? Word, word. Yeah. Yeah, you can hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I can hear you now. Cash, you there? Yeah, I'm good. I got to send you. Did you the co-host? Nah, I still ain't label you the co-host. I'm not yeah, that way, That way, I can just pull up. Uh, yeah. So I know you, you so, know you new to it. Yeah, so how I get you on the co-host? You should. You click his name, and it should say add his co-host. All right, click his name. Report, block, remove. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro, what's up? We like uh we uh, not even two weeks away. Thanks. Nah, I'm 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 ready though. Like uh you know, before I start talking my shit, I'ma just say I appreciate them giving me the shot, you dig? Yeah, definitely not nah, that well deserved, bro. Well deserved you out there doing your thing, man. <laughs> Out there doing, I was just talking to Cash the other day. I said, "Yo, he got another event he putting on." I said, "He got another event he promoting that he not even on." I said, "This man working." He's like, yeah, "Oh yeah, that's how he do. He working." That's all. That's all I do is work, man. I don't, I don't know how to do nothing else. You know, that's what it is. Now, it, now New Orleans is that? Is this a home game for you? Or oh, yes, not? yes, indeed, all the way. Okay, ah, uh, all the way. I, I think you know. I don't think it's gonna be to the point where I'm gassed out the building or uh or where well, all's got anything to worry about. Like, cause I ain't even taking that route material wise. Like, I ain't I ain't about to have bars about second lines and parades and Mardi Gras and, and uh, all that shit. Like, I ain't even taking that route because I want this material to be able to reach a million views and for everybody to relate to, it, not just my city. Okay. Yeah. Okay, all right. So there ain't nothing awesome we gotta worry about. It's gonna feel pretty mutual because I ain't gonna be in there saying nothing to pander to the crowd and shit. Like, like I'm trying to show that I'm I'm supposed to be top tier myself. So that's what I'm treating this battle like. Okay, definitely. Nah, that's that's a definitely have a focus. People automatically they got a home game. That's the first thing they do. But it's too smart. And you battle somebody, you do your homework on the home crowd. Mm -hmm. I, I always thought that was the, the, the most important thing to do. You learn what's the spots in that town. Like, right? know what I mean? So when you mention something the crowd, okay, he did his homework. Yeah, so, nah, and I think I think Austin is going to be uh, in great hands when it comes to that because I know he done really clocked us on time in the city. Yeah, he lived there for a minute. He lived there oh, yeah. for a minute. So I'm interested to see what he about to bring to the table, but that ain't my MO at all. Like, that's not what I'm on. That's not what I'm coming in there for, to, to rap about. I got you. Cash, are you, you straight as co-host now? You set? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We lit there. Now, Cabo, let me ask you this about the young hitters that's on the card. The young Deezys, the Funk, the Monster. Like, you know what I mean? You, 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 I'm not sure you're familiar with them. How you think they coming? Oh, Monster, you know, like, 
Monster, uh, Monster had a little setback. Okay. That, that uh, that you know that 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 jail shit could really just throw you off completely. Like I don't care if you spend a week in jail, it could mm-hmm. still fuck, it could still fuck your life up. You dig? So facts. The fact he back outside at the at uh-huh. the donor, at the donor's little jokes, the nigga for real, he, he earned his name. He's really a monster. <laughs> you feel me? So I don't I don't know if. I don't know if Chef Trez is safe. And, and Trez, Trez, my dog. Like, Trez really, Trez really a king of the South. He deserve all his flowers. He deserve props for getting the South this fall. Yeah, but uh, Monster, three. yeah, Monster was been supposed to be up, up here. Monster was been supposed to have having these type of matches and shit, man. So I think Monster about to go fucking crazy. I seen him against official. He did his thing with official. Oh man, come on, man! Yeah. You no know, official badge money, so I ain't about to fully co-sign that. But uh, yeah, now nah, she always official's official regardless. But that was my first time being in tune with him when I seen that. I was like, oh shit, this, he's spitting, he talking. So like, nah, you know I mean? nah, monster, monster for real, like that. Like uh, they be always trying to compare me to twerk, and I don't think you compare me to twerk energy wise. But I think monster's one of the people you can for real compare to twerk. Like that nigga got that energy, and when he start. When he really get in that bag, it could get uh-huh. dark for you. Mm. It could get so this dark. This gonna be a goodie. Oh yeah, cause Trez gonna do what he do too. Chef Trez is still a chef. He's still gonna cook. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Chef, chef, uh, chef was staying. I was just watching him and Kid Chaos. That was a crazy match. Yeah, yeah, yes, indeed. And uh, Funk, I'm ready to see Funk back outside. I ain't see Funk in a minute, but. From what I heard, he, he did spectacular last time he was outside. I fuck with Funk. Uh, young DZ. <laughs> I'm interested to see what happened with DZ, man. Last time I heard about DZ, he was he was getting kicked out of Crucible and shit. I'm sure that's going to be one of the angles, nigga. You <laughs> yeah. That's the thing about battle rap, yo. And that's what I think about with up-and-comers. I'm going to ask everybody this question. Are up-and-comers at a better advantage than somebody that's seasoned? Like you, nah, you've been dancing nah. around on stage. They not because nah. you don't got no ammo on them. You don't have no ammo on up and comers. That that I, I feel like I feel like the vets have it better in that situation. I feel like that's not all the only reason us newcomers getting accepted this quick is because they need new names to flip. Like ain't none mm. ain't none name flip wise. I can say the awesome that he ain't heard okay. already. Facts, facts. You feel me? And I feel like that about every vet. So I think every vet lucky to be this season because certain angles get played out. Mm. Yeah, you can't hear it. How many bus jokes you on here? Yeah, like, you know what I mean? That's, yeah. that's crazy. I get it. I always really want to know how people felt about that catch. What you think? No, nah, what Capo said, right? Uh, what so he, he said, was... right. It's so, it, 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 it could be. And it could be, uh, and you got to worry about going against the star power and shit as well, too. Like, like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They always, a uh, nigga, that, that's the thing about being a vet. You always got that, that plus on you. You could be up there saying the hardest shit, and sometimes that shit bounce off a, a nigga who just got that stardom, dog. Mm, yeah, yeah, nah, that's a fact. The start, the legends know how to control the stage. They know how to win. Like, you know what I mean, mm-hmm. they could be upset and get somebody. As they used to say about, you know, Shug, when she's like, Shug been in his lyrical bag lately. But prior to him being in his lyrical bag, like people said he was in, they say, yo, Shug know how to win. Shug know how to win. That's why him and B Magic going to be a crazy fight. I'm going to be Magic. Thanks. Woo! That's going to be a good one, B Magic and Shug. Thanks. And Shug said he not losing a round 2024. He said he won that champion in a year. He not losing a round. He will if you're around set us up. He gonna have to lose somewhere. Ah. <laughs> hey, Shug, you hear this, bro? Uh-uh. He was like, um, be magic. Don't even talk loud enough to beat me. Nah, I think Shug. I think uh I think <laughs> the same way. I think the same way. I think uh I think be magic got his hands full because Shug just a thriving a place like New Orleans, cause New Orleans just got a bunch of motherfuckers that just like Shug. You feel me? So ah, uh, ah, uh, okay, okay. And what, what about Hustle with Elada Mayor? Oh, Hustle walking there. Ah, 
Hustle, you know, hustle. Hustle the reason B Magic on the way out. Hustle the best back to back puncher to enter the game. Damn. Since B Magic. Damn. Yeah. Okay. So a lot of because a lot of men got that aggression. He used that aggression, that aggression, you know. He got that, that aggression. He got that aggression. He got that OG. I'ma uh -huh. talk to you. I'm gonna I'm tell you about my real life. You can tell uh -huh. he actually, you can tell he actually live that shit. Yeah. But that ain't, that ain't got nothing to do with Hustle. <sighs> yeah, Hustle said in his, uh, it was chopping up arms. He said, I'm the mayor here. I think he said, I'm the mayor here. Yeah, like, that ain't got nothing to do. Like, that, that dude, that for real, one of the most consistent punches I'd have never seen. And I, I'd be with the best of them these days. Damn, that's what's up. That's why I told everybody this card is, this card is fire. Every match on this card is a dog fight. Because I'm looking forward to seeing Sharon and Danny Myers. I think that's, that's going to be crazy. Crazy rebuttal. That's what but, I think we're going to come down to. Whoever goes second wins. Sure, sure. Uh, Sharon and Danny Myers, are we, we doing predictions here? Yeah, we're gonna do, we can do predictions. I, I Capo, who you got in there? Huh? Who you got in the Sharon and... Uh, Danny Myers, man. Man, I'm biased. You know I'm honorary EFB. I got Danny. Danny. <laughs> All right. I'm going to say Sharon. I'm going to say Sharon. 2-1. It's about knowing you on the yeah. bottom, and I don't know if Sharon been down here enough. Danny really be sitting in these trenches with us. Mm, yeah, see? see yeah, nah, that's a, that's a fact. But, That's a fact, but, but you know, Sharon and Danny is is one of them matches where Sharon, dog, he ain't, he ain't got to sit in the trenches. We don't expect him to sit here. Right. You feel me? And like, he, he, he going to bring 100% every time. You know this, uh, L, Yeah, he found the from, way to From adapt. watching him in yeah. person. He found the way to adapt because even when we brought him to Newark, we brought him to Newark. He, yeah, Nark Grimes. Yeah, he ain't. Man, listen, he is way out of his element, but he found the way to adapt. He found the way to adapt. He do it every time. Oh, nah, this white boy gonna come down here. Nah, Sharon ain't on that type of time. He find a way to adapt to the crowd. We know we can look at him and tell like, I he's not from the trenches. We know that. But Sharon finds a way to adapt. That's that star power we talk about again. Mm -hmm. So that that's gonna be a goodie. That's what, all right. Um, if you had to predict shotgun sugar and be magic cop, who you going with? I'm going with Shug, uh two one. I think Shug gonna fuck up in the round, and that's gonna be the round magic get. And uh, hey, I'm been consistent. Hey, you seen Ace Amin and Shug? Oh, that was crazy. Yeah, so he's been consistent. So I don't know. if he stay on this path, yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But Mag, Magic and Arsh just had a classic. The Magic and Arsh just had a classic on RBD. Hey, you know, I didn't watch that a couple times. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I already know the shit. Our right, catch, who you going with? Sugar Magic. I say Shug. Sure. Shug, sure, sure. Okay, okay. It could be. It was. What's crazy though is, I wouldn't be surprised if Magic uh, upset it. You know what I'm saying? Me neither. Because, because Magic been the the new Magic. He it looked like he got it together. He didn't finally mix the new era with. What he trying to do? You feel what I'm saying? So it could be tricky, like uh, be magic punch his ass all dog. Like, yeah, that's fact. That's his, that's his game, but like uh, shotgun Shug just he he more entertaining. Oh, Shug control that so stage. Independent. Shug control that stage. Oh yeah, yeah he Shug, Shug. It's and Shug punch. It's the, you know you know what? I'm not gonna hold you. Capo and Shug would be fucking crazy. Nah, that's gonna happen. Yeah, cop on sugar gonna be fucking crazy. All right, what about official? She home, official, but Loso ain't no pushover. Thirty. Thirty. Dirty thirty. Come on, man. Official more the king of the south than Loso is. Loso from the south too. Ah. Loso, he he act different when he battle a female. That aggression is like ten times heavier. So they did the vixen. Thanks. But official one of them, she ain't well, official, official she uh, 30 low, so that's a crazy company. Man, official my top five. I love the way she, since day one, she hit that stage. I said, oh, shit, where'd she come from? So, all right, 30 copper. Um, Cash, you got 32 with official? 
Nah. What you going low so? Uh. Uh-uh. Nah, I say two one debatable. Two one debatable. Mm. Yeah, but this is this a I I say official should pull this off in her hometown. It's her first home game. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, her first home game. First she home been game. gone a while, but yeah. Loso ain't no pusho. Loso, no. Loso ain't no punk, dog. And then when they come down to battling females, the nigga really, that's his element, I guess. You feel me? For real. <laughs> like, like, do so, you notice how he turned like, up differently when he battled female? Like, he literally turned yeah, up Yeah, that's a fact. All right, what about, um, yeah, that's a fact. Kappa, what about Geechee and Ines? That might that's I think that's gonna be one of the most uh entertaining battles of the night, first of all. Like I think that's a sleeper battle. Um mm. I got mm. Geechee. I got Geechee, but I got Ines probably having one of the moments of the night. Ah, uh, facts. We just um pulled up where Ines said Dre Dennis Gates the Garden event, he battled O Solo. And I had to um do a blog with him. He was saying how he he know everybody got him as an underdog, and he appreciated that. He wanted to be like that. He said because he got a surprise for Geechee. I was like, you got a surprise? He said, yeah, I got I got a nice surprise for Geechee. Everybody got me as an underdog. He said, let Geechee come in with all that. Uh, you a bitch. And all that. He said, wait. Yeah, 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 right. Dude. I'm not sleep on in this, dude. I'm not sleep on anything Philly. Anything Philly, I feel like a cheat code, so. Yeah, Ines can rap. People like forget that he can. Ines can rap. Cash, what about you, Geechee and Ines? Geechee, Geechee just didn't face too much, bro. That nigga, uh, Ines though, a rapping ass nigga though. Exactly. Dog. This thing, like, son, is a fucking probably got the most verses in battle rap. Like, as far as a rapper. That nigga just rap his ass off. When I went to Philly just a while ago, he was in the studio up there while everybody down there battling. They was in the same spot. Like that nigga just a rapping ass nigga. So it ain't, it ain't about to be no pushover. Hell like, this no. a big battle for eating that. I think this might be his probably, I don't want to say it like I, that, but it's probably be the biggest biggest battle for him in a while. Yeah, because I, I, I don't want to say it like that either because Ines is a legend himself. Like, you know what I mean? So I I don't want to say that right, right. may be his biggest battle because you know, both of them reached that le- legend status. So I, I don't know if it's going to be his biggest battle, but I definitely think that because of the fact that people sleeping on Ines, he, he coming crazy. He, he about to do something like, he like I like Capo said, he's going to have a, 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 a mark of the night. He's going to something he's going to do or say or bar he's going to say is going to go viral. That's what, that's what it's going to be. And then what about... Funk, you know I got funk. I know you got funk because you're being biased, right? Because you know I got. Nah, you know, I got. <laughs> you know I got Zay. <laughs> you know that's a fact. I got funk for sure, man. Hey, Capo, what you, you got? Know, funk. What you got with this real sick and cash? Who you got with that, Capo? I got real sick losing. Ah! <laughs> Yo, I just watched him with Pat Stay. That was a fire ass battle, man. That, that was a fire battle, bro. That was a nah. Paste and fucking Witcher call it was crazy. Yeah, Paste and Real Sick was fire, fire. You know, Real Sick started in the tournament. He started with you. That's why y'all people don't know the history of y'all match, Casher. People don't know the history. Y'all started off together and then both ventured off y'all separate ways. Now y'all gotta come back home and shoot that fade. That's a fact, man. It's a personal battle between me and him. Yep. That's why I said I ain't even worrying about the outside noise, L. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I was on that stage, like I said, brother, like, it was me. Yeah. I'm standing on top of the rail right up. Like, I don't, I don't see real sick in the crowd nowhere. Not even in the VIP. Yeah, so they, everybody. You feel me? So, like, I'm, I'm coming in there with that aura, dog. I'm coming in there with that. Still that same nigga that walked in NARC and nobody knowing him, you feel me? And making everybody know me when I leave. I'm right. coming in that shit with, to New Orleans. Bro, like, you know, I know I how there. big this stage is. I was there, I had your L. You feel me? Who the fuck is this Cashin doing this Super Mario Brothers? I was like, bruh, that's Arsenal Artist, Cashin. I was like, yo, who this nigga? It is he crazy. He ripping off his shirt during the battle and everything. I said, yeah, that's Cashin. 
I think y'all might turn out to be the battle of the night because of the history. Yeah, if real shit come on this shit, it, that's what it's gonna be. Yeah, like uh, and he and from me seeing his interviews and shit, he on game. Like he ain't coming here playing around. He he blocking out the noise, and that's why I was saying today on Twitter, I was like, damn the bitch. I was hoping he could come out there playing a little bit, cause the motherfucker rapping right now. But that's what I wanted though, a hundred percent sick and fuck. And I'm gonna give y'all a hundred percent. Whatever happened from there, fuck. The best man win, you heard me. Yeah, nah, sick definitely. I spoke to him. He's not coming playing at all. He never do. He always show up. Cash, make sure you monitor this to see if anybody got questions or anything like that. We want everybody prediction. Everybody prediction. Do we miss any battle? I think that's all of them. We got no speed dollar in G Way Gutter. Now I'm not too familiar with G Way Gutter. Copper, what's up with G Way Gutter? G Way Gutter, one of them. He, he talked that shit. Oh, oh, he told oh, that kind of, he, he told that kind of shit. I told man. Singer, I think Renny Ackerman or David Raindorf was gonna let you know that was gonna lie tonight. Okay, okay. Hey, catch. Uh, um, run it, catch. Hold on a second. Already, man. Yeah. Uh, they got got way more shit, man. Like I said, you know, you got Capo event uh, the day before, man. For uh, the people that are gonna be in town. You feel me? We got Let's Be Real Battle League the day before. Uh, the, the day after, you even you got Flatline. Um, the day after the uh, the new U Dub event. You feel me? So it got it got shit out there for the weekend, man. Just a lot of battle rapping that whole weekend for Louisiana. Yeah, I know so. Connor Circle. Is Mardi Gras going to be over when we out there or is it still going to be going on? Nah, that shit over, thank goodness. Nah, nah. So how's the crowd in New Orleans? I mean, honestly speaking, it's like what, what type of vibe is it? The New York crowd, Philly crowd, what we get? Well, uh, last year, you know, Smack said Battle on the Bayou was one of his favorite crowds. He okay. said that. He said, yeah, he said the New Orleans crowd was one of his favorite crowds. Like, showed he, every showed everybody love, and was receptive, wasn't no booing. Yeah, that's a fact. And uh, the, the fact uh, a lot of uh, battle rappers said that shit. So it ain't like that shit was just... It, it's, it's a crazy place to be down here. Like a lot of motherfuckers that's bad at rapping want to be down here. When you had niggas like Surf saying that's the best city he done been in as far as battle rapping. You feel what I'm saying? Battle rap. Okay. And he ain't even fucking battle rap. Like it's just the experience you're going to get down here. Okay. Well, not dollar. I know I seen that interview with Surf when he was talking about it too. So yeah, I definitely fucked with that. Because a lot of people had a problem with that. Um, with the Philly crowd when Arts battled Cassidy. Like, so on Arts stepped on the stage before he even said his slogan, the crowd was born. Like, they wanted every Philly artist to win that night. They wanted every Philly artist to win. So that's why I was trying to see how to... Yeah, yeah. It was. <laughs> yeah, I was... I was <laughs> with that shit there, I felt that shit through the camera. <laughs> it, ain't, it ain't gonna be like that well, in Louisiana, hey. though. Like Louisiana gonna want to hear everybody. Like they they want to hear fire shit. So they respect bars. Yeah, they don't care if you're from here or not. They want to hear some fire shit. Okay, uh, and, and Coppa, what's next for you after after ours? I know I've seen a, a flyer that you had another match coming up immediately before, immediately after. And does not, that affect your writing for uh, preparation? Having not back to back matches. Not at all, man. It's bad money shit. You know, we follow that uh that Birdman protocol. I'm in the studio every day. So having mm. material and a problem. I was in bags and baddies making money because I had material every day. So coming up, that ain't, that ain't affecting nothing. Um, I got next in Arizona a week before I got awesome. But uh, after that, I don't know what's after that because my price raise after that. I don't know who's going to want to book me. <laughs> It should, right? It should. It should. Yeah, yeah. I ain't, I ain't got no, I ain't got no plans. I'm actually, I'm actually turning down shit, you dig? Cause, cause like I said, I think, I think me and me and us gonna do our million. Oh, facts, facts. That's a fact. Definitely a fact. So I'm gonna ask you this, cause you're an artist too, so you're in the studio as well. Is it hard to do both? 
Fucking right. Fucking right. Yeah, because like you got to do a certain right. bag for battle rap, and then you in the studio. Then you got to get back to that bag for battle rap, then you in the studio. Like, you really it, juggling it, it thing one time? It ain't, it ain't the creating part that's a problem for me. It's more of like not enough 